Hi folks, my name is Hank Goodman and welcome back to North Country Lodge. Uh, we just ended our 2011 bear hunt and I tell you it was extremely exciting. Uh, we had everything from bears wanting to take our bears that the hunters had shot. We had everything from uh, wounded bear hunts at night that were very exciting. Wounded bear hunts during the daytime that was exciting. It was just a great season for us. All in total, we ended up putting 28 bears on our game pole, never mind what else we shot at and passed up. But uh, success-wise, it was just a phenomenal year. So what we're doing now, we're at the time of the year where we're going to put some of these videos together and uh, put it on the computer so you folks can start to see what kind of bears that we get here at North Country Lodge and to see what some of the other hunters had to say about us. So uh, take a look at these clips, and uh, there'll be more coming after this. And uh, I think you're going to find that it's as exciting as the people say it is. So give us a call and we'd love to have you come up here and see us. I'm with Tom Estabrook from Yarmouth, Maine. Tom, you got yourself a beautiful bear here last night. Uh, uh, this is your first bear, I understand? Yes, it is. Yeah, and you've lived in Maine all your life. I have. What's taking you so long? And that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> you know, I've, I've uh, hunted deer and moose in Maine and, and uh, really enjoyed the outdoors, hunted all over the state. Uh, in Bingham, uh, Rope Pond area, Pleasant Ridge, Lawton, Ashland, all around. Never bear hunted. I'm glad we came. You know, fantastic company of people do a great job. Combination of the food that the ladies cook. Right it's fantastic. The timing, everything, the dates, the stands. You really put a lot of work into it. We really appreciate it. Well, thank you very much. You did a wonderful job, and it was a pleasure having you up with us. I'm standing here in front of the old Bear Rock and I'm with uh, Robert Thompson, he's from Lake Wales, Florida. And this was Robert's uh, first bear hunt and what I'd like to do is have Robert uh, tell everybody how was your first ex your first bear hunt and uh, you know, did it, uh, was it basically, was it basically like the information we sent you in the brochure? Uh, it was basically like the information we uh, you sent to me in that there. Like I said, I got a video where you guys sat in your cabin and explained everything. I mean, I got all the information I could get from you folks, and that did, which was all very good, very well edited and all that. And the meals and accommodations here are outstanding. The ladies in the kitchen do a great job of cooking. You gentlemen do go out of your way to help a person while they're here and out there. Uh, one thing I'm, I'm going to throw in here, uh, the one thing that I like to was two gentlemen come up here and evidently they'd never hunted before or never shot the rifle before and you guys went the extra distance to go down and help them get the rifle sighted in and out there and that's the kind of things that you know a first time hunter can uh, expect up here from the North Country Lodge. Well I tell you I just want to say real quickly that Robert called uh, Bert and I at uh, 430 and uh, we were hopefully Johnny on the spot. <laughs> and uh, this was a pretty exciting deal here last night, and uh, it made for a, a good story that uh, Robert's going to be able to tell for a long time. So I just want to say thank you, Robert. Thank you. Uh, we got our work cut out for us right now, and uh, hopefully we're on the rock again here tomorrow. Hey, I'm here today with uh, Steve Kirshner, and he's from Sleepy Creek, West Virginia. And last night he bagged this beautiful sow. Now we've run into a few days, the first couple of days, man, the weather was just bad and, and, it, and it was raining and windy, but the sun cleared up, it looks like a beautiful day today, and yesterday was a gorgeous day, and tell us what happened here, Steve. Well, I'm sitting on the stand about 10 minutes to 7, and uh, she walked into the bait, gave me a perfect shot, and I highly recommend this North Country Lodge, they do a great job, food's excellent, and Don Bryant, my guy, is definitely an asset. He knows how to position these bait sites to the point where when the bear comes in, gives you a great shot. Now this bear was a fighter. It's got a, it looks like its eye is gone and, it, and its uh, ear is, is half gone. But it's a beautiful sow and we got another beautiful day and I'm sure we'll be back on the rock here again. Thank you, well thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome man, thank you. Hey, I'm here with Sherman Hall and he's from Floyd, Virginia. Now this is Sherman's second time up and this is Sherman's second bear. 
and we're uh, Thursday into the first week 2011 and I know where he shot this bear and this man's a heck of a shot so tell us a little bit of uh, what happened here tonight well, like I said it is about six o'clock I heard another shot and uh, I got more alert and I said things are moving and about 50 yards to the right I seen a big head come around the tree and I throw the scope up, and as soon as I seen him, I knew it was a big boar. And I settled it back in the stand, and I gave him about five minutes, and he came on into the bait, and he started eating frosting off a stump, and he was, a tree was right behind his kill zone, so I had to move plumb in the corner of my stand, and he wouldn't move, so I took him where he stood, but I had to make the shot work. And you put the knuckle right on him. Well, listen, Sherman, good job once again. Now you're a true veteran, and uh, we'll have more on the poll to talk about. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching that as much as we did making it. And I want to give a big thanks out to the hunters that were here, because uh, without you guys, we wouldn't be here. And I'll tell you, this is one of the best seasons. It was actually our 27th season, and i got to say it was one of the best seasons that we ever had. So we appreciate everybody that comes up here. And we also want you to stay tuned because as the weeks go on, we're going to be adding more clips of the 2011 season. Uh, we weren't able to put it all together because it would have just been too long. So uh, take a look. I hope you enjoy it. If you want to do something like this, just give us a call. We're always here. We 